all right before i go into the video i just want to apologize for not posting anything about this um series in the past two or three days i've been really really occupied by work and some other things but i'm back now i'm doing the episode and there's probably going to be another episode tomorrow so you guys should stay tuned for that i'm sorry once again but we are a 79 rated player rather zaki levchenko is a 79 rated player we have 12 skill points to apply i wanted to do that um at the beginning of this episode so that's the last one for the acceleration that is where so we're probably like in 94 or 93 pace right now but next is i don't need goalkeeping in my life right now in strength i don't think that we need anything in strength right now i guess stamina is something that we could invest in you know, we should get that out to 82 that is nice depending no yeah we, we really don't need that at all but dribbling uh i think i think i want to like work on my finishing this finishing is not really all that good right now so where the hell is finishing at all right, so there's two points of finishing, get it to 87, another two points, get it to 90. I think I think I'm good with the 90 um, finishing, as in 90 finish, I don't know how it's called, please. Uh, so let's go for free kick accuracy or penalties. If I go for this one, then two points for this, and this will get our shot power and free kick accuracy higher again. So, I mean, is there it's just two points that we have right now? Our long passing or short passing could be way better than we right now. All right, so this will give us all right. So I'm going to work on this before I, I work on, on the short power again. So, where was I just now? All right, so long pass to 71 and short passing to 74. We have a match against Stoke City next, and they are actually were eighth on the table, so like they're not really far behind. So I'm just going to play the highlights for this match. And this is 6.5 match rating, one pass and one goal. I'm going to hand, enhance the one with the passes, and let's see how we can do in this match. I mean, we had a really nice end to the episode last episode, and we're in the second half of the season now. I, I think this is us. I hope this is us. All right, so this is our first penalty ever. Our first fucking penalty ever. This to make it 1-0. Alright, that is our first goal. First goal of the team. First goal against the brother. And it comes to me really, really well to get penalty by Levchenko. Alright, we're going to try and intercept this. Stop this from happening as best as possible. Ryan May. Well, possibilities in the center. Alright, we got it. No counter attack. I don't know why there wasn't even a counter attack. But this is going towards our player. To oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Oh, that, that touch was so bad. That touch was so bad. And it was a very good opportunity. I probably should I probably should have like shot it one time. I don't know why I did it. I actually don't know why I did it. Alright, we have a good chance here. That's, that, that goes straight at the keeper. I probably should have taken it to the left a little bit. But we do score the goal that gets the win for the match. One goal. And I doubt we made a pass. I think we made a pass, but I'm not sure. Alright, so we have a new team in the recommendations, and that is West Ham. And we have almost everything we need to do to earn this contract. But we don't have any headed goals at all. And that's something that could be really hard. Which means we're not going to be able to get into West Ham unless we get three headed goals by the end of the season. And that's going to be so fucking hard to do because our player is short and there's no there's no way we're going to be heading any goals. Alright, first match in the FA Cup. That is this is going to be against Preston North End. And I am not going to be playing the match. I'm going to be saving it in the fact. And oh yeah, we're actually an 80 rated player now. And that is good. But I'm going to simulate this match and let's hope that we get the win. We do, and we do get the goal that gets our team the win again. Now we have yet another match against Preston North End, and we are Still 11 points away from Leeds United. I don't think we're ever going to catch these guys because they're going to keep going and going and going. We had our chance, we fucked it up, and you know, it's nothing we can do about that really now. All we have to do is just make sure we get automatic promotion to the Premier League. And Preston North End, Preston is actually, uh, yeah, they're actually 11 points behind us as well. But Southampton is actually one of our tails, so I mean, we still really need to 
to get away with this match. But before I go to the match, we still have a couple important matches to play. There's this match against um, Middlesbrough, and then we have, I don't know, West Ham, I guess, sorry, West Brom, I, I guess that's a big match. But then we don't even know what we're going to be, who we're going to be facing in the next round of the FA Cup, whether it's a big club from the Premier League or just another club that might even be from the lower league than us. First of all, let's get it's going by Manchester again, get one goal, one pass. All right, so that is, yeah, I'm doing the highlights, obviously. So I, I guess that's the only thing we're going to have to get to the highlights. So I think I should actually stop repeating that over and over again in the video. But a long cross by Leicester City. All right, so this might be as good as what we got. Or no, it's not. Is that offside? Yeah, it is, obviously. Let's try to stop this from happening no matter what. We need okay. to to keep our win streak going in the in the league right now. We, don't, we really do not need any anything that will actually set us back. So Well that was a big tackle from us, but I mean nothing came of it. Crossing opportunity for Leicester City. We have Cassidy here. And how about the cross? Block. What can actually come of this? Oh crap, the deflection was wicked, but the keeper was able to get to it. Cross the opportunity for Leicester again. I, I guess this is our. Oh, it's not a player, but we can get this to our player if I want to. Successfully got past him. Assist, maybe? No, no assist for us there. But it was, it was good. I wish we had a counter-attack. Because it's actually pretty stupid that they keep giving us those long crosses and normal crosses and stuff. I mean, so hard to do anything with those counter-attack. And they don't give us a counter-attack. Cross over to this is the last chance that we have to score with. So, I mean, we're obviously going to be going in with our players. There's no way in hell I'm going to be crossing, crossing this ball. Maybe give it to Daka, and of course, and nothing happens from that. So that's a, a stupid draw. Very, very fucking stupid draw that we just endured in this match. Alright, we have Middlesbrough next. Really nothing else to do. Um, okay, Leeds United drew their match, if I'm not wrong. Or they lost, rather. They probably lost, and we drew, which means we're now 10 points behind them. Alright, so I mean, it's progress. So let's just hope that we don't lose any more matches and we should be good. Leicester City wins the match 2-0. Daka and Ricardo Pereira are the ones that get to go for us. Next up, we have Stoke City in the away cup. And I'm not going to be playing any of this um, FA Cup matches until we get to somewhere that I can actually want to play. Because I, I really don't think I'm, I'm interested in winning the FA Cup with Leicester City. It would, it would be nice if it happens. Yeah. But, I mean, if the game doesn't want us to, then we're not going to. But... We do get a goal in the FA Cup again in the 43 minutes. Cody and Cassidy get the other goals for Leicester City. All right, so before I move on to the next match, I have a bit of news. We have scored 21, 22 goals in our career in, in 33 appearances. That is really, really good. And this is just our first season. So Nike has set up a deal and we are now their latest ambassador for the Nike boots. And these are the boots right here. We got some Nike Superfly Elite. And yeah, they look they look really really thick. They're actually one of the new boots in the game. And yeah. So we're now one of Nike's ambassadors. That's a good thing. Moving on, we have Huddersfield next. So I'm going to jump to results and see how well we can do against Huddersfield in this match. 3-0. And we do get injured in the match. We got two goals, but we get injured. That is fucking sad. But I hope I hope it's not a big injury because if it's a big injury, then that's going to be so bad. But we probably were subbed off. I actually didn't see if he got subbed off at all. But we got two goals in the match. So I really don't understand why we didn't get... We got an 8.9 match rating. I mean, that's pretty stupid, to be honest, that we didn't get up to 9.0. 9 but, um, advance one hour. It's okay, so we're supposed to be skipping the... Okay, so it's not really a bad injury. We actually are match fit in four days. So I'm really happy that um, we are not... Um, getting fucked up on the sidelines for a long ass time all right we're going to be skipping this match because we are not match fit but they draw the match all right so that is not good i really didn't want that to happen at all and because of that leads have actually gone 12 points ahead of us that is sad 
really fucking sad, but we're going to be playing the next match. And that one is going to be against Millwall. Why not agree to the media interview? It's good publicity. Fans love to know a little bit. All right. So I didn't even notice there was a, there was a, uh, whatever. Sponsored photo shoot. Okay. So start in the launch video of a new line of leisure clothing. Okay. So we actually do get an actual um, sponsorship. That is good. We get 42.5 thousand pounds for that. All right, so we have Millwall, we have Sheffield Wednesday, we have West Brom, and we have Birmingham to play for the rest of this month. And we actually haven't played any matches in this episode, so I guess I'm going to play that West Brom match because there's not really a lot that I want to play to be honest. But I'm going to do the the highlights for this one against Millwall. Uh, we're actually low on health. Hmm or stamina rather, or fitness rather. All right, so we didn't get to look at the objective, but I accidentally skipped it. And we have, what, long cross by Leicester City. Okay, so this is straight to Patrick Dakar, so let's hope that we actually do this well, and that's a good goal from him. That's a really good goal from him. I really wish our player was able to do that. Really wish he was, he was able to do that, but okay, so we they have a penalty. Shit, it's not even us. All right, so I call left. I call left. Left, 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 left. Shit. <laughs> All right, so that's not that's not good. But um, crossing opportunity for Leicester City. This is our player that's on the ball here. Obviously not. Never ever going to be for some reason. But uh, we're going to give it to him here. And let's see if we can. We probably should have passed that ball there. But I don't know why. I mean, I just want to know it's really amazing goal for my player, and it's probably not for the best because I mean, we're trying, we're chasing Leeds United that have pretty much run away. Good example of pressing without the ball. I really wish, I really wish I can actually get the ball here. Oh, actually, I actually do. Please counter attack. Please counter attack. Patin Daka. Can you score? Yes. So that's two one for our team here that's that's amazing okay so one next long cross by Leicester City okay this is going straight for passing back here once again and yeah our player is what the hell was that I mean our player was not involved in anything at all in this match I don't even know why I mean just I mean all the chances that we had couldn't have involved our player yet apart from that one that we actually got a, a shot from goal. So I guess it was actually it was actually uh, good that I actually was selfish there because I, I mean I had no chances apart from that one in the entirety of this match. Up next I have Sheffield Wednesday and where are they on the table though? They are are they really that far down? They are 17. So I'm not really interested in playing this match to be honest. Uh so let's see what we can do. And we do get the win so we get a goal in 40th minutes that year another goal so we're actually scoring a lot of goals in the uh whatchamacallit in the um simulations now and we actually do get the ball in the match what was our objective 9.5 all right so media interview togetherness around the club commitment for everyone rate yourself highly okay so talk about the unity behind the scenes at the club and make sure you share credit for the team success for maverick we have explained that even your high requirements from staff are met yeah, we are in starts and we don't have high requirements. I mean, the, the, the Maverick options sometimes are just too out of that. So I'm going to go for the heartbeat one. And manager for performance, heartbeat obviously. Let's try to make everybody happy. Winning, winning goal scored. Of course, I'm going to post clips of your goal on your social media. Of course, I'm going to do that. All right, I just want to brief reminder of the teams that we can actually go to next season. Uh, first of all, we can actually renew with Leicester in case we have to. Then Sheffield United, we can come here. Leverkusen, we need two cheap shots to be able to get to this team next season. Atletico Bilbao, we need two more first time shots to be able to get to the team. Um, West Ham, we need three headed goals. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So it's just Sheffield United and it's just Sheffield United that we can that we can get in. And Atletico Bilbao, if I'm not wrong. All right, so we have West Brom. Um, these guys should be high up. Yeah, they're ninth on the table. So I'm going to be playing the full match for this match. All right, so I think this is the only match that I'm going to be playing in this episode. I'm going to be playing the full match of it. We are an 80 rated player. I think we're the... Okay, so I think we're probably a bit less than a mini. So we're second in the team right now in terms of ratings. And uh, I want to apologize if my, my voice sounds like I'm talking from my nose because I, I in fact am because uh, my nose is actually kind of blocked. 
health issues and all. But I mean, I'll be fine. But I just want to apologize in case you know it's kind of disturbing the audio or something like that. I don't know, but yeah. All right, so a 9.0 by 13 pass success rate of 60% and win or draw. Or right, I don't know if this is FA Cup or not. So is, the, is, the, is the championship so it's a win or it's a it's a must win match basically or rather we it's a must not lose match oh we actually did get the header but i mean it was just straight at the opposition now we just calm down with the way we run at the defenders i mean if we see a a route through that's when we should run and yeah this this has to be a goal come on this has to be a goal Thank you. I'm, not, I'm just going to do the greedy real quick. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so it's a, it's a really quick goal. Really good situation we found ourselves in. I mean, we're straight in for the counter there. And, I mean, he's, he was not going to miss that. So I think our finishing is on 90 right now. So there's no there's no way he's going to be missing easy shit like this now. It looks like we have a free kick thing here. Our uh, shot power is actually really, really bad. <laughs> So I'm going to have to fill this all the way, and our curve isn't really all that. So, all right, I guess I guess I probably shouldn't have done that. I just needed a lot of power on that. So I should have actually dropped it a little bit so that it doesn't go high. All right, they do be doing some dumb shit, but I'm really impressed with what I have here, and I think that's a goal, definitely. Definitely. All right, so I don't know why I did that, but okay. I want to I actually want to see what that Rashford celebration is. All right, so I didn't find it. I actually don't even know what it's called. I'm going to have to like search for that later on. But I mean, our players do really well, so I might, I might just have to like um, automatically add it to his, or rather, manually add it to his celebration list so that he can just do it if I just press X. But yeah, that that was a that was a good goal from from uh, left check over there. Get the ball from him. What the hell are you doing? All right, it's half time now. We were starting on the second half. I actually have no idea what happened to my camera just then. Like he froze or something that I didn't even notice at all. All right, so we are oh shit. We, we actually would have got it there. We just got, oh, assist maybe? Yeah, that's not going to happen. And I don't like it when they don't even like try to fight for the ball. I mean, they just look at it and. Let the opposition just like take it for some reason. Well Alright, give me thank you. So we are definitely on the hat trick here. Hat trick, please. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, that is what we needed. We needed that too much. So that's the second hat trick of our career. And yeah, it's it's easy goals actually, but I mean we're getting we're putting ourselves in the right positions and we're getting the goals that we need here. Alright, so that's the end of our of our game. Right there, we are going off for a head at you and we do a nine point nine by straighting. We get sixty minutes play, three goals, three shots on target, and I'm going to simulate the rest of the match. Let's hope that our team does get the win here. Okay, so we do get the win. The team doesn't fuck up or anything, but our three goals are what stands and what gets our team to win there. So we go all three of our objectives we got a 10.0 match rating we got a 72 percent pass success rate and we got a win i actually cannot believe that we are still drawn on goals with patrick bamford i mean the guy doesn't want to give up for some reason like bro what <laughs> all right so we're still 24 goals and he's got 24 goals as well i mean he's still the better of the two of us because he has the same amount of goals in less games and i'm really really getting ticked off about that because why the hell is he scoring so much we have um, a surprise match here. The last match of the month is it going to be the money game where we have any more. It's going to be against Aston Villa. So I'm definitely going to be playing the full match of that one. We're definitely going to be um, getting a loss because that's a Premier League side. We get the win against Bremen Hans City and it's a really big win that we scored though. But Fatal will get a brace. Mendaka and Pride score at the end of the match to get the win for our team. Alright, next up we have Aston Villa. Is the team going to be able to pull off something absolutely amazing here? I really hope so because I want to go into the next round of the FA Cup. I mean, I said that I really didn't care. I and mean, the truth is I don't, I actually don't, but I just want to see our team, you know, get somewhere in the FA Cup. And I don't know what round this is. I should probably check what round this is real quick. This is uh, the, 
it doesn't show what round it is. Round five, okay, it's round five. And after round five, we have the quarterfinals probably. Yeah, so this this is basically round of sixteen. Yeah. And there's still Manchester United, there's still Chelsea, there's still Manchester City. Okay, Liverpool is out. There's still Arsenal and Spurs. Whoever wins that match will still be in the game, in the, in the competition. So, I mean, there's a lot of big teams that we have to face. And I really hope that we can get a win in this match to get a chance to face any of those teams. So, we can have, like, so we can know how we can actually fare against Premier League sides. All right, so we're supposed to get a 7.5 match rating, two shots on target, and a dribble sub area of 30, and which I'm going to be enhancing into a 40. All right, can we get the ball to us here? Oh, damn! And that just continues our amazing form. That was a really good goal. That was a really fucking good goal. I mean, look at my reaction. I'm like, damn, straight up. I mean, I thought he had already fucked up with the uh, cross, but he actually did well to get the ball behind the defenders. And they were able to like stop that from getting to me. That was a really good goal. We've actually scored in every single FA Cup match we've played, and that's that's actually a really good start to this match. And I really hope that the team can uh, hold on to it because we need we need, we really need to hold on to that. All right, can we do something here? The diagonal run from us, and who can we get this to? Nobody, sadly. That was a very good cross. That was a very very bad cross from our team there. And uh, can we do something here? Yes, we can. Can we score? No, we can't. Shit. Probably should have passed. Probably should have passed. Yeah, I'm so fucking selfish, man. <laughs> All right, so if we... Yeah, this is exactly what I wanted. And... Uh, can we get... No, we can't. Not a very good pass. Not a very good control from Daka there. And yeah, that's the end of the attack, basically. Zaki. Okay, good to get past the defense. Can find the right pass? And we can probably do something here. No, it's long gone. Can you do something? Oh, he caught it. Damn. That is brilliant. And all right, so this is good control. And now uh, we were able to get in between them. I really wish I was. Okay, so it's half time. And it's been a good match, basically. I mean, we have the one goal that is separating our team from theirs. And it's been a really, a really good match, actually, for Leicester City. Alright, so this is becoming really scary. I don't know why they're not trying. Come on, you guys can't just get the fucking ball. You can't just get the fucking ball. Just put your leg in there and get the fucking ball from them. Alright, so that's a good save. I didn't really try that much, but it was still a really good save. I, I really do not want them to score. I want us to be able to get as far as possible here in the FA Cup. And this match, we should be able to win it rather easily so please come on do not okay okay keeper is doing really well keeper is actually saving our asses here so we need a counter a counter please come on come on can we go around zaki an effective challenge Cash. Oh my days, no. Alright, so he fucked it up for himself there. No fucking hell. I was just dumb as fuck. And with that, we don't even deserve to win this match, to be honest. Right. Didi was fucking strolling there when he could have just tried to get the ball as best as possible. Come on, just. Fight for the fucking ball. Fight for the fucking ball, guys. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. This was so avoidable, it was so fucking avoidable. Alright, so this might be a good chance. 
If you can't just get past this defenders, I get a short goal. Crucial piece of defending. Appeared to be into Leon Bailey. Plenty of support here. Correa. A real opening now. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. We'll just get the pokey ball. It did look on for them, but not to be. Now Alright, we have a possibility here. Yeah, Please! Oh my god, what the hell is that torch? Yeah, there's obviously no win this match. We, we've lost the match. Fair and square, and there's really nothing that, that I can do here that was going to make it look better. That, that's just so fucked up, to be honest. I feel, I feel like I have been cheated like this match was a fucking fraud there's nothing that i've done about it because it seems just so fucking stupid and i hope i'm not here next season but yeah it's so crazy how a player with so much potential can get stuck in a bullshit team like this so crazy man but we are in level 27 now and we have 12 skill points available and we're going to be using those for our player in the next episode we're not eight points behind Leeds united they have drawn a couple of their matches so we are a lot closer we're just three matches behind them but we are obviously not going to be catching them i really don't think that is that is a possibility to be honest unless they would unless they lose every single match after this all right so we can talk to our agents about moving to a more successful club the next transfer window that's a really shitty thing to do but that's what i want because i'm i mean that much i mean after realizing we just just that was no cap yeah but we had the upper hand in that match and the way they scored their first goal was so fucking stupid. I mean, it was so avoidable. But, I mean, the team is just so dense that that just couldn't happen. They couldn't just stop it. Well, finally, we are on the shortlist for Player of the Month in the Championship and we got a hat-trick and we had a really good episode. We had a really good episode because we scored in almost every match that we played. So, I really hope that this is going to be our first Player of the Month that we win. I really hope so. But anyway, guys, this is the end of the episode. If you guys have enjoyed it so far, make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'll be posting FC24 content every single day. I'm actually working on a Create a Club Caramel series coming, like, it's coming pretty soon, but it's going to be relatively different from what I normally do. Yeah, it's going to be different. Really, really different. I mean, some people might not like it, but that's just what I want for that particular series. I'm going to be focusing more on this one. So I don't need that one to be like a really big distraction at all. I just want it there. It's not going to be the way this one is yet. So yeah, thank you for watching once again. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.